This is Tamara Baluja, I'm the social media editor here in Vancouver, and I'm going to be testing out the new Mobi. Okay, so the first step is signing up for a new account. So you need to go on the mobibikes.ca website, and here we go. So if you have any questions about what it's like to use the bike share, uh, snap them at us and I'll try and get them answered to you. Okay, so here's what the bike actually looks like. This is where you put in your key pass. This is uh, a picnic basket where you can store things. So that's the bell, the helmet, and the bike lock. Okay, we also have the lights here, a guard to protect you when during rain, and a kickstand. Okay, so we're ready to bike it, so I'm going to turn it on, and I'm going to press 2 to wake it up, and then follow the instructions. So now it wants me to enter a user code. And then you enter in the code. The bike is unlocked, um, but of course the helmet fell straight to the ground because it was actually attached to this thingy. I was actually confused by the gears because I wanted to press these things, but turns out you have to actually twist them and turn them that way. Okay, so this is pretty fun. It's easy to do, but there are a couple of pitfalls that I think you guys should know. Okay, so I normally ride in the city bike, which are pretty light, but this is super heavy. So I'm very grateful that they have these helmets, but at the same time, I'm a bit of a germaphobe and if I could wear my own helmet, I would do it. I've also tried out bike shares in London, England and in Toronto and the Moby is actually the easiest and most straightforward to use. The lock this thing actually really does matter because if you put it in like this, somebody could just come along and unclip. I don't know if this is a foolproof method, but what I would do is put it through these two, like so. There are 23 of these bike stations, and by the end, there will be 150. I actually spoke to someone who was wondering where the next bike station is, and uh, that's a good point. There's nothing to show to you right now. You have to go to the website at mobibikes.ca. Question from Snapchat, are there any wipes for the helmets? And the answer is, uh-uh. Okay, thanks everybody for following CBC Vancouver as we try out the Moby, and I want to give a special thanks to Tina Lovegreen who helped me put this together.